Hi there friends, Ashley Childers here. And as an interior and product designer, my mission for the past 15 years has been to help homeowners create a home that truly inspires them. Because I believe everyone deserves to love where they live. But equally as important as the home environments we create for ourselves is the habits we form in those spaces because they have a huge impact on our overall happiness and well-being. So today I'm sharing the five habits that have completely transformed my life over the last year. They're quick, easy, and have brought me more joy and meaning to every day than I've ever thought possible. And I think they can help you do the same. Habit number one is starting each day with gratitude, intention, and my daily big three. Now, daily big three can be goals you want to achieve with work, healthy living practices you want to stick to, like eating a nourishing lunch or taking a walk after dinner, or they can be creative pursuits like cooking a meal for yourself, gardening, or getting a few chapters in on your favorite new book. There are no rules when it comes to your daily big three, and they can be a combination of goals, practices, and pursuits. The key here is to acknowledge the three most important things you'd like to achieve each day and do it. They can be simple and fun or strategic and targeted. The point is that they are personalized to you and by accomplishing them, you'll immediately feel more fulfilled, productive, and joyful. Another bonus of setting your daily big three is that it helps to mitigate the never ending to-do list and get you focused on what's really important. And the result is that you'll accomplish more than you'd ever imagined and enjoy doing it along the way. Habit number four is to prioritize your overall mental and physical health. Now, I'm a little embarrassed to admit that I'm a workaholic. I do love my job, I love my family, and just like so many of you, I've always prioritized the needs and wants of those around me over my own. As a result, I've spent more than a decade of my life overworked and oftentimes underfulfilled, honestly. It was only when my husband and I became empty nesters that I realized I was the one responsible for neglecting my overall well being because I was habitually choosing to not make it important in my life. So I made the decision to do just a little better every day. I started to focus on my physical health by eating more whole foods, moving my body at least three times a week, and I really took a hard look at my mental well-being and realized I was desperate for more fun dinners with my mom and sister, more weekends spent in the garden, and more free time to pursue the hobbies that I hadn't in years. I encourage you to take the time to really assess what's missing in your life. For me, it wasn't about being in perfect physical condition or having my social calendar full each and every week. It was about living the life I truly want and having the energy, vitality, and self-awareness to do so. Now, as a part of this video, I'm linking a free printable habit tracker that can help you create these habits for yourself. I've included my favorite inspirational quotes and mindset prompts to get you motivated and moving in the right direction, and you can download it below. On to habit number three and what has become a non-negotiable for me, and that is to spend time outside each day. It can be a short walk, a stroll around the garden with my morning cup of coffee, or just sitting on the porch for a few minutes. Once I started making this a priority, I saw a huge shift in my mood and outlook from day to day. I believe that connecting to nature, even if it's only for a few minutes, has a massive impact on our well-being. It grounds us, connects us to the seasonal shifts of nature, and gives us an energy and life force that we can only get through the natural world. I challenge you to try this one out. Go outside at least once a day and take a few minutes to just soak in the sights and sounds. It's going to make a difference in how you feel, I guarantee it. Habit number two is probably one of my very favorite ones of all, and it is that I intentionally started celebrating the small wins and little luxuries of life. The world is hectic and our lives are busy, which makes it so easy to brush off the small daily accomplishments and little sparks of joy that happen throughout a week. But that is the meat and potatoes of life. And if we don't take time to recognize them, we're really robbing ourselves of so much joy. So let's take the time to celebrate the small stuff. It's really where the magic happens. Now, before I share my number one habit, I'd like to say how much I'd love to connect with you over on Instagram, Pinterest, and our blog at Ashley Childers Home. Our online community 
has become such a wonderful source of inspiration and I'd really love for you to become a part of it. Now, on to the number one habit that has impacted me the most over the last year, and that is every day I give myself permission to focus on my needs, wants, dreams, and desires. This is a big one, you guys, especially for those of us who spent years raising a family or focusing first on the needs of others. Now, I'm not saying to neglect your people or become self-absorbed. I'm just saying that I've seen a transformation that taking a bit of bandwidth for yourself can result in, and it's life-giving. So give yourself permission to focus on you, to spend some time doing what you want to do and what lights you up. You'll never regret having more happiness and meaning in your life, and that's good for you and the ones you love most. Now guys, if you want more inspiration on how to bring beauty, purpose, and a joy to your home, I want you to watch this video next. Thank you for watching, y'all, and remember, Good design is for everyone. So create a home that inspires you, set habits for yourself that bring intention and happiness to each and every day, and fall in love with where you live one room at a time.